In this video, I'll show you how to turn on line numbers in SQL Developer. Line numbers are the numbers that are shown on the left of your SQL Developer code editor window. They help you to know how many lines of code you've written. And more importantly, they help you to debug your queries, as any error messages that appear will give you a line number to where the error occurred. By default, in SQL Developer, they are turned off, but they are easy to turn on. Let's see how to do that. First, open up SQL Developer. This is the Mac version of SQL Developer, but the Windows version looks very similar. Open up the preferences in SQL Developer. In Windows, this appears under the Tools menu. On the Mac version, click on Oracle SQL Developer on the left here. Then click on Preferences. The Preferences window will then open. There are two ways that you can find the Line Numbers option. You can click on the arrow next to Code Editor to expand that, and then click on Line Gutter. There's an option here for Show Line Numbers, which is unchecked by default. Click on the checkbox for that to be enabled. Alternatively, you can use the search function inside the Preferences window here. If I type in the word Line, it will show me where that word appears, under Code Editor and Line Gutter. Using either method, once you've checked that checkbox, you can then click OK on the bottom right here. You'll then see line numbers that appear in SQL Developer here. It starts at 1 and goes all the way down to the bottom of your file. This way, when you run a command and get an error, it will tell you what line the error occurred at, and you can see in your code here which line it refers to. So that's how you can enable line numbers in SQL Developer. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel by using the big subscribe button on the page to keep up to date with all the Oracle SQL videos that are released. Also, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and leave a comment as well.